<laughs> hey guys, um, I haven't been making, I haven't made a video in a little while, and my hair looks, what the fuck is, I don't, anyways, I, I haven't made a video for a really long time, because my computer has been being a complete douche. I look like I kind of got a sunburn on my face. Anyways, I wanted to talk about the Billy Tower concert a while ago. It was amazing. That's all I could say. It was fan fucking fantastic. Um, I got a haircut. I cut my hair. Literally, I cut it since the last video. Um, yeah. I'm putting it the wrong way. But, yeah. Um, Billy Tower concert was fantastic. Like, he did an excellent job and, like, I don't know. It was just great. Um, yeah. Today, I had a pretty good day at school, you know. Not just the fact that I woke up at 2.30 fucking a.m. Yesterday I came back from my friend's house. Um, I got home around 4. I had a huge migraine, like a massive migraine that nearly killed me. Like, it was insane. I was able to walk in the sun to a cast clip on the road, it's called Swellens, to get the best foot stand ever. Like, ever. They have the best. That's all I could say about that. Came home, ate it, um, sat in the bath for like an hour. Um, <laughs> I just lost my voice that my friend sent me. Anyways, um, yeah. That didn't help my headache. I took two Tylenol, like extra strength. Yeah, it didn't help that either. I ended up passing out around 6.30, hoping that I would get in a little nap. No, I ended up waking up at 2.30 a.m. And then I couldn't go back to bed. I probably got like a 15 minute sleep after that. And then I was up until I had to wake up for school. Yay! So, that went totally horrible, but I was able to catch in, catch in, what? I, my friend Alex, in one of my previous videos, named like, oh, I hate you, Alex, just kidding, because he's on my YouTube channel, um, yeah, I, he gave me like half his rock star in the morning, so I'm kind of happy for that, thanks, Alex, um, other than that, my day was wet. Well, I had blackberry strawberries for breakfast. Woo! My other way, my best friend Thea, she wanted to draw a heart in Sharpie, and she messed up, so she so she decided to smudge it. Alex wrote, you can't barely see, barely see it. It was on the bus, so you can it's good. Take this vagina pointing up my arm. Great. Um, yeah. Um, I was, since I was in town, um, Saturday, well, um, Friday, on my way to my friend's house, we went to the promenades in uh, Getsno Hall, between that area. Uh, I picked up socks. I finally got new shoes, so I don't have those shoes with holes in them being held together with tuck tape. Went to our dens, got these fucking nice ass shoes, got little spikes on them, happy for that. Um, I got socks, woo, socks. Um, what else did I get? I got those shoes, I got socks. I think that's it, what I got from our dens, um, that day. No, 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 I got a really nice pair of shorts, they're gray, but it's like two-tone gray, kind of, I guess like this, light gray, dark gray, but it was camo, and like the uh, bottom of it, like, was shredded, so it looked really nice, I enjoyed it so much, um, yeah, Saturday, I got a nice sunburn. Um, my friend's mom, she has this really nice, uh, 
camera it's Nikon or something um yeah it was I ended up taking a lot of awesome like they were really nice pictures with uh, my friend yeah and after like it was her little brother's little birthday party and I ended up falling asleep for like 10 minutes in the sun but I was out in the sun before then too so I got a nice sunburn like fairly you, know, you can sort of see it it's red shoulders and I got like a little thing like this on my back because I was wearing my Billy Talent shirt that I cut so it looked really hilarious and I wore a dress today so people saw that yeah I Melanie wore a fucking dress it was a nice dress though sorry Talk to my friend Facebook. Maybe. And I guess my face got a little red too. Yeah. Um Saturday. Um after the party and after we had like barbecue, I got to see Brandon. We picked him up at the fuck am I doing? <laughs> We picked him up at Tim Hortons and drove him back down to the apartment. I got to spend like time with him and I'm really happy for that because I haven't seen him for like three weeks. About a little over three weeks I guess. And we barely left each other's side. It was really cute and I felt really happy. And I was even happier because my friend finally got to meet him. And they got together really good. They're both nerds. So they were talking about Pokemon half the time. But Pokemon. I love Pokemon. But it was hilarious. They come on find like who's best Pokemon. Which I laughed. Um, yeah, it was really cute. Like we'd be joking around and he'd say something like jokingly, but kinda mean. But I knew he was joking because we do this all the time, and I'd pretend to be like this, I'd be like, yeah, I'm not talking to you, why, and I'd like start to walk away, and then he'd follow me, and then he'd like run up to me, and like grab me from, like hug me from behind, like and he'd wrap his arms around my, my waist, and he, he wouldn't let go, it was so fucking adorable, like I've never been this happy before, and I'm glad it's with him, because He's the one who makes me happy. I don't know why I said that, but I said it like that anyway. That was kind of retarded and stupid. My hair is being a complete dick. Like, I don't know. I think it's because I, I spent like an hour in the shower, like in the bathtub, like soaking in the bath, and like didn't even shower. My hair feels like there's a whole bunch of chlorine in it, which I have no chlorine in my water. But you know, whenever you like swim in a chlorine filled pool and like your hair gets all like really weird and stiff and puffy and it's like, what the fuck is going on here, man? Yeah, that's what it feels like. Um, Sunday before I came back, I went back to the promenades, but I went to Urban Planet. That's the word. That's, that's the story. Urban Planet. That's where I got my nice dress. Um, it's one of the, oh, and I got this shirt in Nirvana. I got a nice tank top with skulls and uh, crosses on it. But anyways, the dress, it's really nice. Um, I enjoy it anyways. I'll go get it for you, but that means I have to go downstairs and back upstairs. I'm just going to explain it. it. Right here, like here, um, yeah, it goes to here. It's like a mock jean, but there's more like um, spandex in it. There's a little bit of jean. But it's not real jean. Anyways, then the straps go here. There's like little studs on it. But the top ends here. Yeah, it ends here. And then there's like the dress part. But um, it ends. Um, back up. Yeah, it stops here. So it goes up to here. Yeah, up to here, and then in the back, it goes up to, I think, mid-calf. 
So it's really, really nice. And the bag is really fucking nice too. Um, it's not too girly, that's why I like it. It's not too like, yeah, it's not too girly. So, and I wore that today. And I got tons of compliments. Except I think I don't like them. I think my boobs look really small. I'm a girl, but I, I don't know. Anyways, anyways, nobody cares. But yeah, besides waking up super fucking early, I had a good day. Mm -hmm. I got this nice um, rock. It's a little stone. Looks like a jelly bean, but it's not. It's a stone. I got that the other day too. And yeah. So I have to say this. I have to explain this. Shout out to a really good friend of mine. His name is Sam. Sam Kennelly. Shout out to you, bro. Um, at first, since I got home, he's been telling me how he's been like really. He's he scared himself shitless more or less. There was a bee in his room, and it flew past his face, and he got scared. So much that he jumped up from his room and ran all the way downstairs to the living room. And he's been talking about it so much. It's like, oh my god, it was so funny. It was just so funny. I just had to. Yeah. Yeah. So I have really nothing really much to talk about right now and I'm probably boring the fucking hell out of you so see you guys later. Um yeah. Peace. See ya.